Whether you like it or not, the world is moving towards total electrification, and that includes our beloved trucks. We showed you a prototype electric Jeep Wrangler at SEMA 2016, and while that was cool, another company called Bollinger Motors just revealed their fully electric prototype sports utility truck. After taking a closer look, we think that this could be the electric truck that changes the game. Hey guys, Ken here with another news refresh. Wanna win some free stuff? We're running a contest to win all this centerline gear. Check out the description for the link to enter. So what makes the Bollinger B1 so intriguing? Honestly, the electric powertrain allows for some pretty unique features that you'll never see in a vehicle with a combustion engine. Plus it looks pretty badass if you ignore that front end that's basic and ugly and need the logo at least on it or some sort of design elements. I don't, it's, it's rough. That's pretty rough. The rest is awesome, but that's gotta go. We'll start by going over the basics of the powertrain, chassis and suspension, and then move on to things that make this vehicle really special. Similar to Tesla's vehicles, the B1 uses a skateboard style battery pack and frame with a dual motor design, which provides full time all wheel drive. It has front and rear independent hydropneumatic suspension. So it's no slouch in the off-road department, which of course, we love. It's also got a formidable approach angle of 56 degrees, a breakover angle of 33 degrees, and departure of 53 degrees, with 15 and a half inches of ground clearance, thanks to portal axles. Dual motors make an equivalent of 360 horsepower and 472 pound-feet of torque. Let's not forget that electric motors make torque nearly instantly. The B1's top speed is 127 miles per hour and can go up to 200 miles on a single charge. The truck is technically a class three truck because of its 10,001 GVWR. That puts it in the same category as the F350, Ram 3500, and Sierra 3500, but it weighs only 3,900 pounds and has a payload capacity of 6,900 pounds. This thing's no joke. Okay, so those are the basic things that every video about a new truck has to include, but this is where things really start to get interesting. Since the B1 is basically a giant battery on wheels, there's multiple different power sources, including 12 volt, USB, and a few 110 volt plugs throughout the entire vehicle. They've also made it extremely easy to take off the hardtop over the rear and turn it into a proper truck. Simply take off a few bolts, remove the rear seats, drop in the rear window unit, and put those bolts right back in. Brand new vehicle. Like a Tesla, there's storage space under the hood since there's no engine. Have you ever heard of the term for this? I think everyone's calling it a frunk. I think that's frunkly blame. <laughs> it's pretty frunked up. It's a frunk and stupid term. But what makes the B1 unique is that it includes a pass-through. You can actually fit a 12 foot long two x four with the tailgate and the front gate, the for gate, I guess, up with, or you can, <laughs> I guess it's a for gate. Or you can go ahead and put both gates down and basically fit any length board you want. Got a 20 foot two x four, the B1 can transport it. Got a 100 foot two x four, B1 doesn't have time to play around. Throw that two x four in there and let's get moving. Since this is just a prototype, they haven't announced pricing details yet. So tell us in the comments below how much you think the Bollinger B1 will cost and if you'd ever wanna buy one. Until next time, I'm Ken with Four Wheel Line and you've just been refreshed.